Hi, my name is Shil. I'm the personal trainer here at the Clinic. Hi, my name is Gomi Beans and I'm the client. <laughs> so when I came in for treatment, I was trying to recover from um, long COVID and um, I'd had COVID twice and um, I'd got to a point where I was trying to get back to exercise but I just couldn't do it for myself um, and I was having issues with like just my chest, my back, my arm, anxiety and just not being able to function as well as what I've got to now. We're used to being a certain level of fitness and there was a bit of conflict involved with what, how, you, how you were versus how you used to be before that? Absolutely, mm. that's something I really struggled with because I was at a really good fitness level and then not being able to walk up the stairs, not able to go for a comfortable walk um, and just having a heavy chest, feeling tight and then actually being able to feel your heart when you're walking like, you know, just a short distance. That's some of the things I struggled with and I think mentally is that sort of capacity this is where this is how i used to be and now suddenly i can't do anything so that was a, a mental challenge and for yourself sure what was your, would you say was your, your main priority when you and me first started to work together uh, my main priority was i wanted to me to feel comfortable in the session first of all because in our first session we really started had to start really back from the start again and even with light weights even with basic exercises um Gumi was finding it really challenging so I wanted to really try and increase her confidence and so we took it slowly and by slow progressions um, she got better and her, when, but once the confidence grew and once she started seeing some results and that's it, that's all, she just needed a little push and a little bit of guidance, once she got that now she's um, into her own. Because I've got over 10 years experience in this field I've trained a whole variety of individuals um, so I think my experience really helped me there, but I'm quite an empathetic kind of um, person as well. So I know how it, I know how it is because I've, I've got a family myself. You know, I work as well, so I I come from a different understanding from maybe be someone who hasn't been through that. And so I know exactly where uh, Gummy is kind of coming from. So that was the best way. I can exercise again. Um, I appreciate the fact that I can actually do two sessions a week and um, go for comfortable walks and recently I mentioned yeah. to you that I've got back on the treadmill as well so it's yeah and also I think it's the self-esteem and the confidence that yeah. definitely is that I've, I've got it back again so thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so um, at the moment is, is to me she's made progression really good progression I must say and um, but it's just to keep getting her stronger now and her end goal is she does want to start running more consistently so i think that's the main goal that we're going to push through but again we're going to take her time but she's got to a level now she she's better than what she actually thinks even though she's made a lot of progress as well because i can see it and you know it's been an absolute privilege to see a gummy and so, someone go through that journey and yeah it's been really good and we're going to just keep pushing forward as much as we can in contact with me uh, through the revitalized website or you can uh, access the Facebook page or the Instagram page.